Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and this is my 729th Energy Drink Review video. It's 5.34 p.m., and it's Wednesday, September 14th, 2016. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the second one of the redesigned NOS Energy Drinks. Um, I thought it had like, an, like a word before the grape on the old can, so I guess it didn't. It was just called the Grape NOS. Um, but the cherry one was called, like, Loaded Cherry, and there was Charged Citrus. So I thought it was, like, something grape, but I guess I forgot. This just says grape on it. But now it's called GT Grape. Aw, oh, yeah, look at that can. This is brand new, just came out in the redesigned cans. They're a dollar in, I think, 50 cents at my local grocery store, Homeland. And they're two for three dollars at my local gas station, so they're pretty cheap. I don't know what price they are at Walmart. I think a dollar and fifty cents. Not like a dollar eighty-eight cents, like they're monsters and stuff. But anyway, it's pretty cool. It's called GT Grape now. Reminds me of Dragon Ball GT. Step into the Grand Tour. Yeah, you know what that means. But yeah, it has a silver top with a silver tab. Around the top it says Complex 6 High Performance Energy Plus Enhanced Mental Focus. The side says Complex 6 is Taurine, Caffeine and Ostal, Vitamin B6, Guarana, and Vitamin B12. NOS High Performance Energy Drink, GT Grape. Natural and Artificial Flavor Energy Drink, 16 fluid ounces, 473 milliliters. Says the same thing on this side, except it has a ball logo and another code in the SKU. NOS Nutrition Facts, serving size 8 fluid ounces, servings per container 2. And now, since um, NOS is like distributed by Monster and stuff, well, it's distributed by Coke, but Monster owns it now, has like the design of like the Monster cans, it says like per can, you know? But anyway, I'll read the per can. Um, calories 210, total fat 0 grams, 0%. Sodium is 410 milligrams, 17%. Total carbs 54 grams, 18%. Sugars 54 grams. Sorry for the reflection of the light. Protein 0 grams, vitamin B6 200%. Vitamin B12 200%. Doesn't have any pantothenic acid in it, so that's weird. Or, I guess, nice and two. But yeah. Has other ingredients. Um, natural and artificial flavors. But yeah, manufactured for NOS Energy Company, 2390, and Selmo Drive, Corona, California, 92879, USA. Copyright 2016, NOS Energy Company. Okay. Caffeine from all sources, 80 milligrams per 8 foot ounce serving, 160 milligrams per can. Consume responsibly, not recommended for children, people sensitive to caffeine, pregnant women, or women who are nursing. Refrigerate after opening, recycle NOS cans. DrinkNOS.com has a Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube logos. At the bottom is just a code. It's like the monster codes now. It says like when the, like the drink was produced. So that's cool. But yeah, I'm thinking about getting a new tablet soon, and maybe a new camera. Um, because I forgot to tell you in my last review. Well, I don't know if I forgot or what. But, um, I'm going to be getting the good internet back. Probably within, like, the next two weeks. So I'll be able to get start getting caught up on my reviews. Thinking about uploading a lot in one week. Ten reviews a day for seven days straight. That's 70 new reviews will be uploaded. If all goes according to plan, anyway, probably will happen, because my brother needs the internet to do his schoolwork. But yeah, it's a pretty cool purple can, I like it. Can's getting sweaty.
crap. I don't know if I forgot to show you the bottom. There it is. Okay. Then this side it has the same thing. Except on this side it has the ball logo. Can't really see it that well. Another code in the SKU. Okay. Well, if I can hold the can good without dropping it, that'd be really good. Okay, and there's a, didn't see that, there's a little U above the SKU. So yeah. Anyway, here's nutrition facts. I don't know if you'll be able to see it that well or not. I'll just show it to you in parts, I guess. Uh, the can keeps getting sweaty, I'm sorry. Okay, there's the ingredients. Hopefully you can see it okay. The edge was getting sweaty. Okay. Like almost every second it keeps getting sweaty again, so I'm sorry. There's the distributor information. Yeah, it's made where monster energy drinks are made now. In Corona, California. As part of their monsters deal with Coke. Monster, like, got the rights to, like, NOS and Full Throttle and Burn. So Monster makes the can designs now. But anyway, it looks pretty cool. And I'm going to shake it up, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. Spoiler warning, I already had one of these, and it's different than the old one. That's why I decided to re-review it. But anyway, hold on a minute. I don't know if you could hear that, but it's bubbling pretty good. Now the smell. <sighs> Why'd they do this? Before the Grape Nos, I really liked it because, um, it wasn't your typical grape, like, a drink. Um, this smells more like a grape soda, or like one of those grape relaxation drinks. It's like a typical grape smell, like a sweet but a little bit sour grape smell. But um, the old Nos, I liked it because um, I don't know why, but it reminded me of like a Wonka type candy. It was like a more happy but fruity but weird smell. You know, you would know if you smelt it. Yeah, but this smells like your typical like grape soda or like a grape relaxation drink smell. It's not that interesting, basically. Um, but yeah, the color is about the same as the old Grape Noss, though. Um, but the old Grape Noss was way more carbonated. It looked way more, um, fizzy. I don't know if you can see that color really well. Because of my lighting. Uh, wait a minute, I might have to pour a little bit more out. I was trying not to spill it, but I spilled a little bit on my shirt. Right there. But, uh, fucking tablet shadow. Sorry for my language. But, um, I don't know if this is a Mandela effect or what, but the sun used to didn't go out, like, come in my room as, like, harsh and bright. Um, now it's, like, coming directly in my room, so the sun keeps, like, messing with me. Used to didn't do that, but yeah, there's the colors, like, a, um, light, darkish purple color. It's basically the best I can show it to you, like, right there. Okay. See, now the sun's, like, blinding behind me. My old videos, they didn't used to do that. So that's weird. 
Um, but anyway, I'm not gonna try it. Yep. Way more smooth and more watered down. Um, the old grape nose used to be thicker. Had more of a bubbling, like, carbonation. Like it used to hurt going down your throat. Yep. Disappointing. This is more like your avid, like, I can't talk right, sorry. It's more like your average grape soda taste or flavor. And it's more like, um, like other grape sodas and relaxation drinks. Um, the old grape nos was more unique, I think. It reminded me of like a Wonka type of candies. Um, but, you know, this is like, <sighs> this is more syrupy. It's more watered down. It's more smooth, so you can drink it better, but I don't know why I like the older Grape Nos better. There's just like the Wonka type flavor to it. I like the smell of it better. I like the hard like carbonation. Um, but yeah, you can drink this better though, but it's not as unique now. It's like a typical average grape flavor. <sighs> it could have been way better. I should have just stayed with their old formula. But yeah, it's still okay. I still recommend trying it, but... I like it, but... I like the old Grape Noss better, in my personal opinion. But this is still pretty good. I still like this, but um, I prefer the old design kind. I'm going to give the GT Grape Noss Energy Drink... I forgot to say, energy-wise, it lasts about four and a half hours to about five and a half hours, so it works pretty good. Um, it's cheap. It's like, you know, two for three dollars at my local gas station, so like a dollar and fifty cents each. Um, and I like the can design. It's pretty cool. But the flavor could have been a little bit better. But I'm going to give the GT Grape NOS Energy Drink a nine out of ten. Yeah, it's still good, and I still recommend you trying it, but... I actually prefer the old NOS grape energy drink way more. It was more unique to me. I don't know, some people I talked to said they liked this better, but I don't like it as much. But, you know, it's still pretty good, but I still prefer the old design, so I give it a 9 out of 10. My next review, I'm going to be reviewing the Cherry NOS energy drink. And they did change the name of that one. It was called Loaded Cherry before. Now it's called Cherried Out, so I'll be reviewing that in my next review. See you more reviews, see you more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out and bye.